welcome to Grizzly Tales for Gruesome Kids. A series of cautionary tales for lovers of squeam. Pies don't just make themselves, you know. There's the filling, pastry and the thumbs to keep the pastry crusty. Of course, one could use a spider, but spiders can't take the heat. I call this tale the Pie Man. Get off! <laughs> Donald was a sucker. When he was born, he was sucking. When he was weighed, he was sucking. When he was cuddled, fed and burped, he was sucking. Silly little sucker thumb, socks and titties, digits numb. Ignoring what he knows is true, the pie man has a rendezvous. Crusty, flaky pastry pie, chop a thumb to hold crust high. Meaty, sweetie bone and nail, cures a sucker without fail. What are you saying to him? Said Donald's mother. If Donald don't stop this sucking soon, the pie man will surely chop his thumbs off. Said the nurse. Pie man? Pie man, patty man, feel or fella. They're all the same demon baker, darling. He uses little thumbs to prop up the pastry tops on his pies. To let out the steam. To keep the pastry crusty. Thumbs? Whose thumbs? Why, thumb suckers, thumbs, of course. Little bloodless thumbs with tooth marks. But if he only uses the thumbs to hold up his pastry, what does he do with the rest of the child? He throws it away. Thumbs is all he needs. Fine thumbs like sweet bananas. It was decided that Donald should stop sucking his thumb. But Donald was only one week old and did not want to stop. What's the matter with you? cried his over-anxious father. Do you want your thumb chopped off? Obviously he did. Because no matter how hard his parents tried to separate Donald from his thumb, it wouldn't budge. Which was why Donald's parents rushed out and bought their son a dummy. Which solved the pie man problem but conjured a demon that was far, far worse. As Donald grew up, the dummy became a part of his face. He sucked it everywhere. At school, in the pool, in restaurants, in the slips, and once whilst playing blow football. He lost 323 nil, but getting rid of the dummy was easier said than done. One night, Donald's father sprang an ambush. But Donald sucked back. They buried the dummy in the garden, but Hurricane Donald dug it up again. They hurled the dummy on top of a moving bus, but Donald stopped the traffic. They even fed it to a live snake. But such was his need that Donald turned the snake inside out like a sock. Then, on Donald's 11th birthday, his parents took him to Loch Ness for a special treat. To see the monster, said his mother. There is no monster, sighed Donald. Just cold water and trees. And he sighed again. This was his mother's chance while he was breathing out. She twisted the dummy out of his mouth and hurled it into the lock with a triumphant cheer. 
but Donald plunged in after it and was swimming about in the inky depths when who should loom out of the darkness but the Loch Ness Monster! The dummy's gone, he said glumly. There's a monster sucking it now. And Donald's parents danced for joy. Their son was cured. Or was he? No, not the thumb. Take it out now, or the pie man will take it out for you. Mm, not if I'm sucking it, he won't. This really is dead delicious. In order to retrieve the dummy, Donald's parents showed Nessie's baby how to suck its toes. But Donald was no longer interested. Yuck! No thanks. Thumbs for me from now on. And that was the end of that. Or should I say... him? That night... Donald retired to bed early to suck his thumbs when he heard a bicycle skid to a halt on the pavement outside. There was a ping of a bell, then a click of the front gate, and footsteps on the path. The doorbell rang. His parents opened the front door. Pies? said the voice of the stranger. Then the front door slammed, and Donald watched the stranger step back onto the front path. Donald! Don't suck your thumb! I'm not sucking my thumb. I'm sucking thumbs. Not if you want to keep them! Hello, Donald. We meet at last. Are you the pie man? Yes. And I hear that you are a monumental sucker. I can suck out a sheep's eyeball at 20 paces. Really? How useful. Donald! Donald! If you'd just like to place your thumbs on the dish, I won't keep you any longer than I have to. But Donald had not stopped sucking since the day he was born. You won't get them out, he said. I can suck forever. So you wish to play games? Said the pie man. Ha ha ha! I win, you lose. There is more than one way to bake a pie. Donald. What are you doing? Today, I am baking man pie. <laughs> <laughs> and that is what Donald's parents found. A hot, steaming, succulent pie with a hot, steaming, sucker thumb filling. <laughs> I know one spider that's not going to suck its thumb anymore. Are you, Spindle Shanks? Well, go on then. Have one last big suck before you give it up forever. Oops! Not that big, you stupid spider. You've sucked all your fur off. <laughs>